Aqualung Carbon Capture had a vision to find the most impactful technology to help decarbonize the world and lower greenhouse gas emissions. A technology that could be economically feasible for a wide range of industrial clients where carbon capture has not been possible until now. And in our global search, we found the Norwegian University of Science and Technology. NTNU is a world-leading research institution for clean energy and sustainable technologies. Its chemical engineering department is at the forefront of membrane innovation. Having developed the second-generation membrane technology for carbon capture from flue gases, in close collaboration with and funded by the Norwegian government, Horizon Europe and industry. It has undergone extensive testing from the lab to industrial pilots and is now ready to be commercialized. So the advantage of the Aqualung technology is that we coat the fiber with a special patent layer. That layer has very high selectivity, means that it likes CO2 much more than a competitor membrane does. That do then correspond to that in our upscale package, we will use less energy for the same CO2 purity as the competitors. So if you look at this fiber from a molecular level, we have incorporated the amines in the wall of the fiber. Means that the amine will reach out, take the CO2 from the flue gas and bring it continuous matter to the inside of the fiber. Due to the chemical potential difference, this can be run for infinite length and will regenerate itself as we are running. So means the fiber will never be depleted and don't need regeneration and can be run continuous. Part of the research here has also been to try to make the wall more permeable. Say that you can get more CO2 through the wall per square centimeter or square millimeter unit. That also then makes that the footprint that you're putting in on, the, say, the ship is much less than competing technologies. The NTNU developed membrane is better because we can use different transport mechanisms simultaneously. You have the amine, but we can also use filler together with amine, limiting the nitrogen or oxygen going through the membrane. And thirdly, we can also use a mobile carrier, not only the fixed one, that will then further pump the CO2 through the membrane, make it even better than a competitor. The group has a long history in membrane separation. This particular focus on CO2 capture we have uh, made a great deal of effort to work on this membrane and also to bring this membrane from the labs to industry applications. I think I'm very proud of uh, the team. Aqualung Carbon Capture has been granted the exclusive worldwide license to commercialize this unique technology for carbon capture from CO2 separation, especially from flue gases. Building on the immense success in the lab and industrial pilots, together with NTNU and industrial partners, Aqualung seeks to deploy the membrane technology across a wide range of CO2 concentration levels and fields that will solidify Aqualung's position as a considerable commercial player in the carbon capture space. Aqualung's mission is to be the lowest cost solution to decarbonize the industrial industry. Join us in making a difference for a sustainable world for generations to come.